Commander to the Situation Room. Commander to the Situation Room. Okay. Commander, good news. The Council has <clears throat> donated a satellite. Our current satellite uplink facility can support up to two satellites. So I recommend we launch the new one immediately. Okay. Suited and have a hope for mess. It's hard. Satellite uplink facilities at maximum capacity. Additional uplink required. Okay. With this additional satellite in place, we've gained a significant upgrade to our overall coverage. I recommend we begin scanning for alien contacts right away. Okay. You're telling me that we should risk the lives of our troops so we can take one of these things alive? Yes. Without a live specimen, I'm afraid we've reached the pinnacle of what my team is able to accomplish. And how do you suggest we do this, Doctor? The autopsy I've just completed confirms that the alien's physiology is quite similar to our own. A highly concentrated electrical current delivered at close range should cause neuro- Close range? And what happens if it doesn't work? Do you really think this is worth the risk? I do. We do not know our enemy. How can we hope to stop something that we do not understand? If we can capture one of these creatures alive, we may be able to communicate with it and interrogate it. Find out what they want, where they're operating from. Yes, that possibility outweighs all risks, in my opinion. I could construct a safe enough facility to house our captive, but I do not know how we could possibly communicate with it. Not to worry. I will see to that. All right. I'll speak to the commander. Yes. Commander, based on Dr. Valen's report, I recommend we begin researching the new weapon she's calling the Arc Thrower in the labs. Once completed, we can send the plans down to engineering for fabrication, and then equip one of our troops with it in the barracks. Dr. Shen and the engineering team are also waiting on approval for construction of the containment facility that we'll need, in order to house the alien captive. Commander to engineering. Commander to engineering. Commander, no doubt you are aware of Dr. Valen's request to capture one of the aliens. A sound plan, but she fails to realize that we lack a facility to safely contain a live specimen. With your approval, my team and I will begin construction of a suitable facility. Thank you, Commander. I'll let you know when the facility is ready. <clears throat> yeah. Dr. Valen has asked to see you, Commander. No doubt she wishes to explain her plan, personally. Commander to the research lab. Commander, I'm sure you've been briefed on my request. With your authorization, we can begin research on the Arc Thrower immediately. Commander to mission control. Commander, we're picking up widespread radio chatter indicating UFO sightings within our current satellite coverage area. We should begin scanning for contacts as soon as possible. Right Looks like that satellite we launched paid off. We're picking up an unidentified fast mover. If we scramble an interceptor now, we may be able to take it down. Raven 1! We have eyes on the bandits. Oh, God. Central, this is 
Seven. We have a confirmed kill on Oki Zero Zero One. I repeat, the UFO is down. I'll copy over. Solid copy, BD Three Seven. Nice work. Central out. All right, people. Retask recon satellite Bravo and get me a visual on that crash site. She's coming into range now, sir. On screen. Magnify. Still in one piece. Commander, I recommend we get a strike team to the crash site immediately. Strike one, prepare for landing. Our target site is near the German border. It looks like the aliens went down in a sparsely populated area. If there are civilians in the area, I hope they stay clear. Clear, big sky. We'll monitor those readings from here. Strike one is authorized to assault the alien craft. Looks like the crash site is dead ahead. We should expect heavy resistance here. There's no telling how many hostiles were on board. Approach the craft with caution and attempt a breach if possible. Nej, der kan være nogen her omkring. Okay. Min fejl. Øh... Jeg bare... Okay... Der... Øh... Oh, 
Nå, men så skal vi spage så meget som muligt igen. Øh. Og så skal vi hjælpe de andre. is still intact. They've got some kind of energy field protecting parts of the ship. I'll have to look for it. I'm tied up hole. Incredible. It seems to have 
vanished. Welcome back, Commander. I wanted to speak to you about our current fleet of interceptors. It's crucial that we keep several of these aircraft on high alert. We'll need them to intercept any future alien contacts, and it's likely we'll suffer some losses in the process. Okay. I think it's also worth mentioning that even a full squadron of interceptors will do no good against our enemy if we don't know where they are. Additional satellite coverage will be required before we are able to detect alien craft elsewhere on the planet. Visit us in engineering should you wish to build additional satellites. Goodbye, Commander. Commander, I realize our troops have to put their own survival first, but every alien we use explosives against is one less opportunity to recover new artifacts. Okay. Uh... We've still got some room to grow up here, but if we really want to expand our facilities, we're going to have to start excavating beneath the base. Unfortunately, the deeper we go, the more it's going to cost. <laughs> 